Mr. Burnaby, New Westminster. Permettre les Canadiens à risque. Le plafond de la responsabilité absolue des exploitants des centrales nucléaires n'a pas été mis à jour depuis 35 ans. Ça veut dire que si un accident, les contribuables canadiens devraient se débrouiller toutes seules. La catastrophe de Fukushima a coûté près de 200 milliards de dollars. Alors pourquoi les conservateurs refilent-ils la patate chaude aux Canadiens pour payer les dégâts d'un désastre nucléaire? Pourquoi sont-ils tellement irresponsables? <rires> Mr. Speaker, the irony here is inescapable because the legislation would have been passed if the NDP had not opposed it the last time. They filibustered at every point. We, were, we, we intend to raise the uh, limit by 10 by, uh, times. Uh, the House leader was a critic at the time. He did everything he could to stall the legislation. The Honourable Member for Burnaby, New Westminster. Well, nice try. Canadians will trust the Environment Commissioner over the PMO talking points any time, Mr. Speaker. Here. And the Commissioner was clear. Conservatives are playing Russian roulette on oil spill cleanups. There's a $30 million liability limit. Super tanker spills cost billions of dollars. And this negligence means our tourism, fishery, and the economies of our coastal communities are all being put at risk. Even one tanker could be Canadian families on the hook for billions of dollars in cleanup costs. So why have the Conservatives left Canadians standing on the edge of a liability cliff? Why are they so irresponsible? <laughs> The Honourable Parliamentary, oh sorry, the Parliamentary Secretary of the Environment. Well, thank you, Mr. Speaker. As I've said earlier, our government is committed to periodically assessing the financial liability to make the system to make sure that Canada's polluter pay system remains the strongest in the world. But, Mr. Speaker, with regard to our Responsible Resource Development Plan, we've undertaken so many act actions to ensure that there's increased pipeline uh, safety inspections, that there's increased uh, safety with regard to tra tanker transport. All of these things were included in our resource Responsible Resource Development Plan, which the NDP voted against. Oh.